Hey, everybody, this is Free One Up. Uh, this is my opinion on how you can make Akuma better for Super Street Fighter 4. But to me, Akuma in Street Fighter 4, he, he's, he's, he's a good character, but I don't think he's cool like he used to be. He's not that same, uh, same mysterious fighter that everybody that is feared throughout the uh, Street Fighter universe, you know, and just pop up on a uh, character select screen at the top, just looking down in the shadows. He ain't that Akuma no more. He used to sit down there and, you know, and, uh, and when, at the end when we fight Bison, he come down and chop Bison. <laughs> Bounce off the ground when he do his little stance, like boom. He ain't that Akuma no more. You know, I mean, he needs to be the Akuma, the wheeling, dealing, kiss stealing, beat him down to the ground that he can't move no more on the floor. Akuma, you know. And this is how I, this is what I would do to him, to uh, make him better. Give him his. First of all, give him his super air fireball that he had on third strike. Yeah, I always go back to third strike with moves, you know. Third strike, he had the air fireball. Uh, if he picked his super art, the fireball, you know, he had that boy in the air on the ground or whatever. He was like, put that boy on the ground and just throw it. Was, that was the biggest fireball he had, the one from the air, you know. Give him that junk. I mean, get make him sub boss again like like boss mode you know if anybody deserves to be broken is uh, it ain't sagging it should be a kuma that's broken because shin and kuma was always getting to my nerves anyway but uh yeah he deserved to be broken because he's a kuma at least he got a reason to be broken if you made him broke he ain't broken no sag is broken but uh people are like oh you ain't gonna talk about sagging man you gonna don't worry i'll get to sagging Rest assured, I ain't done with that big mountain of muscle yet. Uh, yeah, give him the air fireball. Give him his super hurricane kick up in the air. The one he had on third strike. Because uh, that boy was sweet. That thing goes so high up in the air. It's like a... Man, he's like... He in that boy. He was the first one to end it off. He was the first show to end that boy off with one of those hard kicks at the end of the hurricane kick, you know? And just knock you back, you know what I'm saying? The same kick that he, uh, like on third strike on his ending, when he kicked through that submarine in the water. Bring that Akuma back. The sweet Akuma that just, that just used to beat you down. I mean, he just sit there, bada, with that noise he used to make. Ooh, he ain't used to talk. He don't talk. Akuma don't talk. Akuma don't talk. He just, you know, hit them dragon punch. He don't need to make no noise. Akuma don't need to make no noise except that. Mm. And you know what's happening after that. You on the ground. Now he all strike me. Ah, listen to my stupid voice. Yeah, man. Now, what else? Give him his uh. What else? Yeah, he had this the show you rep pod. Show you rep pod. And one Ken's. You know he had no flames because he ain't got it like Ken. <laughs> but he had it. You know the two dragon punches. The super. You no, know, hit that boy. Boom, boom. He had that junk. It don't matter. He had all three specials. He, had, he didn't have a hurricane kick like Ryu. He had a different hurricane kick. But yeah, he had the fireball. He had all types of fireballs. You know, give him his meteor shower. I like that meteor shower from Capcom too, but that's a little bit much for this game. But uh, yeah, give him that. Definitely give him the show you repa. The one, you, whatever. The, or he'd be like, boom, boom, boom. he hit three of them, boy. For real. Just like Ken do. You know, make him sweet like he used to be. And uh, also from Third Strike, I don't know why they didn't give this to him. They need to give him this for Super Street Fighter 4. His, what is it, down three times and the punch button. And when he pounds the ground real hard with one fist, he put his hand up like, phew, and he like, boom, that little shock wave come out and just crush you up, man. Bring that special back. Now that special was sweet. I don't care what nobody say. That's third strike all the way. For real. You trying to make Akuma sweet. You know, not some old herky-jerky, okey-dokey shuffle Akuma with his, uh... They changed up his throw, his little, what is it, dragon punch motion, kick button, the flip, and you, um, do his little grab. You know, he got a flip. 
I think it's called the demon flip or something. And he grabbed you and flip you over. It's all right, but the one from Alpha, he used to grab you, boom, then slam you like, boom. He used to grab you with the uh, with a, a elk with a shoulder breaker on his knee. He used to do that junk. That is hardcore. Bring that junk back instead of the flip and throw him. He used to flip and throw him all right. He used to flip him, slam him on that knee like he's supposed to do. That's a kuma. That's shin a kuma for you. You know what I'm saying? That junk give me hype just thinking about that junk. You know, give him that junk back. Make him hardcore. I mean, he got and let him let his raging demon sound like he really hit like sound like a machine gun hitting you like he used to. Not some then he Yeah, my raging demon. Man, just shut up and do the raging demon. Just do the junk. Make him make the make the sound like each hit from the Raging Demon supposed to sound like it's killing you. Not some old wimpy hit. You know, he's supposed to make that junk sound sweet. Alpha 3 still had the hardest hit sound. You know what I'm saying? Bring that sound back. Just for a cool Raging Demon, if anything else. <laughs> Alright, I'm rambling. Uh, yeah, bring a Kuma. Uh, let his. He needs to be the old mysterious boss he used to be, man. The red eye glowing guy, you know, that ain't scared of nobody, will kill you with his fist and all kind of kicks and what not. Or whatever. How much time? Seven? Dang, I'm going a long way. That's pretty much all. But I want to, as usual, I want to hear y'all thoughts about this. How do you make Akuma better? He the one that should be broken. If anybody, like I said before, Akuma all the way. I mean, that's why I don't usually pick, don't pick him that much. You know, his fireballs is. Yeah, all right, you know, but he used to be the fireball king. Boy, he had the red one. He got the red one now. I mean, you know, whatever, but it's sweet. He used to be like, he used to be way sweet. He used to be faster. Now he just one of the other guys, you know. He just, oh, yeah, that's just a cool. That's just a cool he got there. Oh, yeah, he ain't. You know, that little top knot he had used to mean something, you know what I'm saying? That used to mean a kuma is about to beat you now. That's what it meant. Not no, uh, you gotta be super pro just to use him like, uh, that. Well, you know, you ain't gotta be, you gotta play like Edma just to use him good. No, you ain't gotta play like that, but, uh, yeah. Uh, that's pretty much it for this one. Just make Akuma sweet like he used to be. He don't need that much changing. He just need, need some retuning of some of his moves, you know? And don't give him two raging demons either. Just give him something else. Something. Yeah, but that's pretty much all I got to say about that. And I'm going to catch y'all later. Peace out.